Planet Zoo has been rated E10 plus by the ESRB for crude humor, mild blood, and mild violence. It is generally suitable for people aged 10 years and up. Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. Um, I have something embarrassing to confess here, and that is that I did not mean to be recording this right now and to do all this. As you can see, uh, this is actually a prepared area. Well, um, when you're doing an aquatic habitat or a, a land water slash you know combined habitat you have to plan it out you can't just put it together right well i decided i would jump in the game for a little bit and do some planning and then i bold once i got the plan down i'd bulldoze it all over and uh you know after i was done i'd come back later and redo it so you know it would all be done but instead what i did and this is embarrassing what I did was I uh, I kept building. I got into a groove and was like, oh yeah, this is this is gonna look great. This is just gonna be great. This you know, fantastic. Look at this. This is just. And it was only after about ten minutes of work that I went, I'm not recording any of this. I promised people a habitat for the saltwater crocodile. But I'm building it, and I'm not recording any of this. So what I realized was that, holy shit, I should probably turn the camera on and actually, uh, uh, you know, record what I was doing. So you guys could actually see it being put together. And, you know, my... my uh, uh, my rational brain the one that you know works like everybody else's was like well yeah butler you should do that of course my adhd are nice special brain was like no 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 just keep working keep working so what we're doing obviously is we are uh putting together a a habitat for the saltwater crocodile and uh and yeah, you know, th this is it. This is going to be the, the, the habitat for the saltwater crocodile. What can you do, right? You know, I mean, it's mostly done because I I have, you know, I, I'm, I sometimes lose track. You know, anybody with ADHD can relate to this. I promise you. Anybody. Um, the weird thing is, not only do I have ADHD, I've also got OCD. So I will, you know, get into the groove of something and then suddenly realize, no, no, it's not right. So I'll start over from the beginning. It's kind of pathetic. <laughs> but it is my life. This is the way my brain works. You know, w welcome to my brain, folks. This is, this is how it works. So, uh, yeah. Um... Anyway, since I was already working so hard on getting this uh, getting this right, I figured, you know what, just go ahead and finish it. Turn the recorder on in the middle. You know, the, 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 uh, uh, the folks watching on YouTube will forgive you, especially if what you produce is a really good looking habitat. And I expect that it will be. I mean, I, I you know, I, I, I produce a lot of good looking habitats. You guys know that. And so this is what we're doing. You know, you caught me in the middle because I, uh, I lost track, of, um, lost track of, of time and lost, you know, got so involved. I got into a building groove, you know, I got into a building groove and suddenly it was like, oh yeah, I can do this and I can do that. I can do the other thing. You know, it's gonna be great. It's gonna work. Um, it's just gonna be great, you know. And of course it will be. It will be great. It's just, I really should have started uh, uh, recording at the beginning, you know? I mean, this is, it, this is not bad. It's not a bad thing that happened. It's just, 
you know, I, I, I like showing you guys the process and how it works and where, where it all came from and step by step from the, begin, the beginning. And you really are coming in several, with this one, you're coming in several steps um, in, if you will. And there's not much I can do about it because I don't want to tear it. I, I've done too much. I've built too much at this point to, uh, I built too much at this point to just d d bulldozer it all down and start fresh, you know? So rather than do that, I'm going to start from where I am. Okay. What we're going to do here is we're going to raise these up just a little so they do appear above the ground. And, um, Let's see. What do you mean obstructed? How is this obstructed? Where is it? Oh, I see. Yeah. What if we did that? Because what I want is I want. Hold on, naughty kangaroos, naughty kangaroos. There you go. You're done. Bye bye. Why is? I want the water to be deeper. It ought to be deeper. Where is it not? Why is it not? Uh... Here was my plan. My plan was to have this upper part be all sand. This part here was going to be all sand. And then there, the water would come to just about here, but it's not letting me do that, and I don't know why. Is it this? Hold on. This might, this might do it. Hold on a second. No. Okay, why? Why, 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 why? Why, I don't get it. Okay, hold on just a second. I do not get it, but I will, I, I will, I will try to work around it. We'll see what happens. Okay, flatten. To here. Okay. And once again, it'll go to there, but it won't go any higher, and I don't understand why. I do not get it. I don't get it. Okay, where's the barrier? Let's try something really drastic. Okay. Glass. Now, I'm going to raise it all to about five meters tall. And this is a little ridiculous, but it is what it is. Now, let's see what happens. Rain water. There. Okay, so that's as deep as it wants to go. So. Uh, what we're going to do, edit barrier, we're going to bring this all the way around. 
and Harry the koala is about to die of old age and then we're going to take it down to why is it why is it doing that disrupts water placement I should still be able to do that that doesn't make sense okay Harry the koala has died um, and Kira the common wombat has died okay Harry the koala yep that's a dead koala all right all right so Wallaby, koala. Okay, Elijah the koala. And we also had care of the common wombat. She died. So says that there was fighting in the combo in the, among the common wombats because of overcrowding so let's look at what's going on with them okay this is a juvenile let's uh, let's go ahead and send send him out or quick trade him and then we'll go look for another meal All right, and then we'll go back to figuring out what's going on with with the uh, saltwater crocodiles. All right. But it won't let me, it won't let me lower the, it ought to let me lower to, okay. Let me turn on my build light so I can see what I'm doing. We're going to raise it to just above the water level, that way the the animals cannot escape. Okay, why is... Why is that a disruption? But that is not. You see that? Why is that? Why is that? Why, 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 why? Why is that a why is that a problem? It makes no sense. It just it doesn't. It makes no sense. That that that's nonsensical. Okay. Well, you know what? We will go back to the way it was before. And if it has to be, it has to be. Okay. You know, it's just the way it is. We will deal. I will change my plan. to fit my circumstance, because that's what you do. You change your plan, you adapt and you improvise. Now here's the thing. All right, well, you know what? If that's as much water as I can get, that's as much water as I can get. That's just the way it is. You know?
Alright. Okay, what do I want to do here now? Now I want posts. I want um, logs, beams. All right, thin, large, large two meters. All right. Well, you know what? It's going to take a little longer than I thought to build this, and it's because I uh, somehow got the water rules wrong. <laughs> I mean, go figure. I thought I had it nicely planned and it would be quick and it would work, but you know, no plan survives contact with the enemy. Although when who in this case would be the enemy? I don't know, but you know, you know what they say, ours is not to wonder why, ours is just to do and die, which is grim, but it is what it is. Probably should have recolored these posts um, while I was moving them, you know? It would just have been easier. <laughs> There we go. One last thing. Let's take one of these and just, she'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. All right. More, a little more gentle, I think. Something along the lines of that. Yes, that'll work. All right. Now, what do I need? What do I need? I need this. Oh, there go the dogs again. So, in reality, if I hadn't had the problem with the water, and the, the glass barrier, I probably would already be done by now because, you know, this is not a difficult build. Um, 
Okay, folks, that's it for this session of Planet Zoo. Thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, how about you hit that like button down below there? Subscribe if you haven't already. I can always use more subscribers. And if you want to say something to me, tell me how I'm doing a good job, tell me how I suck, whichever, I look forward to hearing from you down in the comments below. In the meantime, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. The jungle, as old and as true as the sky The forest protected shall prosper The forest neglected shall die You've an aptitude to change attitudes As we have to prove it That's right it's to grab your shovel There's work to do, the world's in trouble You gotta build a zoo